hey what's up guys today we are going to learn how to convert ethyl chloride to propanoic acid and we'll so we will also learn how to convert propanoic acid to ethyl chloride so let's get started if we want to convert ethyl chloride to propanoic acid then we have to increase one carbon right so to increase one carbon we have to do plan what is the mother compound to increase the number of compound in a chain the mother compound is alkyl halide so here we have alkyl halide and just we have add potassium cyanide then this cl will be replaced by cn and will get one more carbon in the chain that is if you add potassium cyanide to ethyl chloride then you will get propane nitrile right and you see in propane nitrile there is one more carbon in the chain than ethyl chloride and if you hydrolyze this propane nitrile by acl and aqueous acl then you will get this propanoic acid right this is propanoic acid well now we'll learn how to convert propanoic acid to to ethyl chloride right so to do so we have to deduct one carbon if we want to uh, convert propanoic acid to ethyl chloride right so what is the mother compound to deduct uh, deduct carbon in the chain the mother compound is amide right so anyhow we have to con convert this compound to amide if you add potassium pentachloride then this wedge this wedge will be replaced by chlorine and you will get acyl chloride here this is propanoyl chloride right and in propanoyl chloride will react with aqueous ammonia and this chlorine will be replaced by ammonia amine group which is propanamide right and this is the mother compound to decrease the number of carbon in a chain if you add bromine plus potassium hydroxide then d then this carbonyl group will be deducted and you will get ethyl amine right this is ethyl amine and this ethyl amine react with sodium nitrate and a cell right that is nitrous acid nitrous acid will come from by the reaction between sodium nitrate and a cell right this nitrous uh, this nitrous acid will convert this amine amine group to wedge group right so this is ethanol and if you add here phosphorus pentachloride then you will get ethyl chloride which is our target compound so thank you for being this video be well